Let's talk about the most important choice, the only real choice in prosperity. Hey guys, Randy Gage here. I want to welcome you to another episode of Prosperity TV. I'm still here in the Dominican Republic and I wanted to do this show about choices. And this is going to be a little deep and this is going to be a little threatening perhaps to some of you. But I think it's a really important topic for prosperity. Uh, there are people who believe you manifest every single thing that happens to you. Every car accident, every tumor, every rainstorm, every everything that somehow we attract all this. And I will admit that there was a time I believed that as well. Uh, I don't, after this two year sabbatical I was on, I wouldn't say I believe that anymore. I just do, I think there's some random stuff that just happens. I do believe we're the co-creators in our existence. We determine if we're going to have a great life, an amazing life, or a prosperous life. Uh, but I do think sometimes stuff just happens. I mean, people's, their seven-year-old daughter gets leukemia. Their uh, 12-year-old son gets killed by a drunk driver. The meteorite lands on your garage. Whatever the case may be, I don't believe we control each and every little and big and medium thing that happens in our life. I do believe we are the architects of our destiny and, and, and we do attract and create most of the stuff that happens to us, but not everything. I was contacted today by a 28-year-old guy on Facebook who's got multiple sclerosis. And uh, he's obviously, you know, he originally posted something on the blog, very negative, and kind of attacked me on something. I reached out to him to find out what was the deal, and just found out he's got some, some. He's going through a rough patch in his life right now. I had some things that haven't gone his way, and then on top of it, he's got multiple sclerosis. 28 year old guy. Uh, so, and he was, you know, asking me about being HIV positive and what that means for me. Uh, and you know what? We don't have a choice in some of this stuff, right? In it happening to us. But the real choice we have, and this is the real choice, the big choice, the important choice, is how we respond to it. And it goes back to something you probably heard me say a hundred thousand times. You can be a victim or you can be a victor, but you can't do both. So you have to choose every so. What happens? Hey, somebody runs in and ruins your car. Somebody you know gets a horrible medical diagnosis. Maybe you get a, medic, a horrible medical diagnosis. Maybe you're the one the meteorite does land on your garage. Okay? We don't have a choice in everything. We have a choice in, you know, we don't control the wind. We control the sail. What direction we're going to turn the sail. So, uh, whether it's the bad medical diagnosis, getting fired from a job, the business failing, the meteorite, whatever it is, we get to choose. Am I going to let this define me? Am I going to let this defeat me? Am I going to allow this to make me a victim and own this victimhood and 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 talk about it all the rest of my life on how I could have, would have, should have been, but except for this thing that happened to me and made me a victim? Or am I choosing to be a victor? And that's the most important decision we'll ever make for prosperity. What do you think about that? Get down below and, and give me your thoughts. And please share the channel, subscribe. And until next week, peace, love you guys, and live rich.